Welcome to this month's energy update. I'm Alice and I'll be your guide for today. For this month, the theme is very strongly felt around calling your power back. I will start by guiding you through journal prompting or what I call soul inquiry process. You might grab a journal and journal with me or simply ask this question to your super conscious self and let the answer come to you. Maybe it will come to you today in the journal or in the activation or maybe in your shower later. Be open and be curious and just play around and see how the answers come to you. Ready? So the first prompt is, in what ways have you been giving your power away? Additional message with this will be, as a star said, you might find yourself walking around on eggshell because we are so different, right? Like you might find yourself really feeling out of place and do not belong here and trying just so hard to fit into a matrix that never worked for you to begin with. So every time that you are trying to do something that is not in alignment with who you are or to be like someone else so that you can fit into the matrix and not be true to yourself, all of those moments you are losing your power by giving it away to other people, by giving it away to the matrix that is not serving you. This is an invitation to look at in all areas of your life. Who have you been giving your power away to? To what system or what notion or belief system or anything that really is just stopping you from being who you truly are and living your fullest, highest self as a starseed? Then those are how you have been giving your power away too. So in what way have you been giving away your power and how so? And that leads you to the second prompt, which is, now that you know how you have been giving your power away, how can you then call your power back? For some of you, maybe it looks like setting boundary so that you know like you are only accessible from this time to that time at work and after work, you're done. You're unplugging and you're nurturing your soul because your self-care comes first. Or for some of you, maybe it is as simple as saying, you know what, I'm going to stop people pleasing right now. So it's more about your willingness and your decision than the actual action. But of course, sometimes it comes with a tangible action as well. So be open to whatever that comes to you. How can you call your power back? And the third one is, how can you empower yourself and others? So this is a theme around self-empowerment as well as taking action, taking inspired action to be specific. So how can you empower yourself first and foremost, and then how can you empower others? For example, you can empower yourself by setting yourself up for a sacred ritual every morning or every night and decide what is your self-empowerment practice will be. Maybe your self-empowerment practice will be to sit there and meditate and listen to what your soul has to tell you for the day. And in that connection with your divine self, you are empowering yourself because you are choosing to be connected with the divine love rather than be dragged around by the fear around you. That's one way of self-empowerment. And you get to choose the shape and form it takes by starting by empowering yourself first. Then the next piece is how can you then empower other people? So for example, you might be able to empower somebody else simply by saying positive words to other people or maybe just spreading your smile as you walk around the street to empower other people to let them know that there is love around and that there is hope around. Or maybe just write a little blog post or something, whatever that makes you happy. So with that, it wraps up the three soul inquiry questions or journal prompts. We are going to come into the soul activation part where I'm going to guide you through just a very simple yet powerful journey of light language activation. So you're going to do nothing except to be open and available to receive. 
So before I start, I just want to remind you that light language is basically the expression of the divine, and it is meant for you to feel it in your heart and understood in your soul level. It's not to be interpreted from your mind. So don't worry if you don't understand what I'm saying. Just be open and be available and curious and. Feel into the energy. The key here is the energy transmission behind it. Make sense? So with that, I invite you to now close your eyes. Just take three deep grounding breath with me, breathing in, letting go, breathing in, letting go, breathing in. Letting go, and you might put one hand on your heart and another one in your belly, as you drop down into your body, into this present moment, into the here and now. You've got nowhere to go but to be here. You've got nothing to do but to do this. You don't have to be anyone else but to be you. Setting the intention and inviting you to repeat this after me. I'm open and available to receive this transmission, healing, and activation. And so it is. Breathing in and out. And so I begin the transmission, specifically calling in the Lyran Star Seed, which is helpful for self empowerment and inspired actions, to come forth to infuse this light language with their energy, and to bring forth the healing and the activation and the transmission that is of the highest good of all of everyone here. Anura kula kula sala una kula ta akru sulu tu utra su ukla ta esuklu tu una la ukru sulu uta la ukul nu upla klesa a esuklu tu ulu krata asuklu tu lu uklesa en kru su ula de okru tu ula sa a en krata ala ta 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 kru sulu tu ula ta la ta 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 esla nu upla la la kla ta kla ta kla ta kla ta kla ta kla ta ta Ella salutu unata ascolto tu 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 Everything that is holding you back, that is stopping you from stepping into your power, releasing them now into the void, and calling all parts of you and all your power back, activating your highest, highest, highest timeline and self. Andra tu ulah dah es kru tu urut kru tu kru tu kru tu uslu tu ablet segeh kreta. In kru tu anala es kru tu oplet kreta kreta kreta. Es kru tu ulah na es kru tu uslu tu ulah kreta es kru na ella na es kru tu ulah. Ella kru tu unul 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 ella. Es kru tu asla es lu ulah ta. Breathing in and out. As you come fully back into your body, into the present moment, declaring that you have received this by saying it is done, it is done, it is done, and so it is. 
With that, I end today's transmission. I'm Alice, and it's great to journey with you today, and I will connect with you again.